We are so glad that you're here with us at 530 on 10 Tampa Bay. I'm Josh Sidorowitz. And I'm Courtney Robinson. First, it might be another sign that real estate prices have peaked or are at least plateauing in our area. A brand new survey from real estate company Redfin crunched recent data to see which housing markets could be most susceptible to a recession. And Tampa, it turns out, makes the top 10. Why us? 10 Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser takes a look inside those numbers. Oh, absolutely. It's starting to turn. Yeah, we're not we're not at peak. We, we've gone past peak. Tampa realtor Kristen Fidel says it's already happening. Prices stabilizing inventory rebounding. I think sellers now that were on the fence for a while. Definitely. If they see that as they see that price start to come down, they, they don't want to miss the boat. It's no surprise, says Fidel, that online real estate giant Redfin identified Tampa as one of the most vulnerable real estate markets in the nation. If our economy were to fall into a recession. The survey looked at 98 metro areas measuring home price volatility, debt to income ratios, and home price growth. The higher the score, the better the chance of a downturn. But even if we drop half of what we gained in the last year, which was around 28 to 30 percent, we're still up. So I don't, I don't think it's going to be all horror stories. Real estate watchers we spoke with seem to share the survey sentiment. Right yes, now. if I'm a buyer, I'm waiting. If I was selling uh, any type of land or a house or a apartment, I would absolutely do it right now. Other Florida markets also in the top 10 include Cape Coral and Northport. Miami, which has also seen steep increases, came in at 25. I mean, it's going to go up, it's going to come down, but overall, over the long haul, um, Tampa is a place people want to come. While a recession could create a price adjustment, economists agree we're not likely to see a housing market crash like the one we saw during the Great Recession about 15 years ago. Home ownership rules are tighter. People have more equity, so they're less likely to be upside down on a loan. And unemployment is still low, so fewer foreclosures and bankruptcies are expected, too. In Tampa, Eric Glasser, 10 Tampa Bay. Meantime, we're all just freaking out about insurance right now, right? Uh, the survey also named real estate markets where prices were predicted to remain most stable in a recession. We'll tell you where those are coming up at 6 o'clock.